Hey everyone, it's Gus with Achievement Hunter. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah, that's way better, dude. I'm buying into it. It's Jeff also, and we're showing a walkthrough <laughs> to show you how to unlock Sigurd's Cradle in Mass Effect 2. Yeah, uh, supposedly, as I understand it, as is known thus far in the universe, there are 17 planets that if you scan, they have missions on them. Correct. Yes, but there's a few that you can't just find. You can't just buy star maps to get to. You gotta do a little bit of work. Right, and Sigurd's Cradle's one of them. And uh, you start like this. After you do the mission for Jacob to resolve his backstory, yeah. in the same system where the Mass Effect Relay is to get there, if you scan this planet, Job, you'll find an anomaly. And that's how it all goes to hell. <laughs> is that... Yeah, that's is this exactly. where you find the archaeological dig site, right? Yeah. It's always yeah. the anomaly in space. Just stay away. It's like how Event Horizon started, right? It's true. Anyway, uh, so yeah, launch a probe, find some shit. Job, is that how you say it? Job, is that the name of this planet? It's pronounced Joab. Joab. It's pronounced Job, I think. Okay. Anyway, you land. There's like a libertarian dude smoking a space cigarette. Dude, space cigarettes are terrible for you. Yeah. That dude's got like four noses, though, so he's okay. Oh, uh, that's a good point. Do you yeah. think he has four lungs? I hope so. Or eight lungs, even? Yeah. yeah. I thought I'd leave this this uh, this in to set a little bit of mood for what's about to happen. Going to have some ass kicking here. The shit's about to hit the fan? The shit has hit the fan. The space okay. fan. The, shit's, <laughs> the space shit has hit the space fan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you get here, and it's pretty typical stuff. Uh, yeah, fight through the blue suns. Yeah, this is everywhere. That's what this mission's all about. Is you find the blue suns base. Well, to do if you do the mission uh, arc, you're supposed to find the blue suns base. But uh, we're gonna go off the, the arc towards the end. Oh, sweet dude. Anyway, you, uh, you you fight through this, and you find a PDA towards the end that tells you uh, they have an artifact, and they're taking it to a spaceship called the Strontium Mule. What is it? What is Strontium? Is that, a, is that an element? Strontium? Yeah. Yeah. Why wow, you want to buy some? I got some. <laughs> Don't, just don't tell anybody about it. Okay, in this base, you find this Prothean video log. And in the interest of keeping this spoiler free, I cut out what you see uh, yeah. from the video log. That's nice of you. Nice boobs, by the way. Yeah, that's, that's Taylor Shepard. She's the hottest <laughs> bitch in the galaxy. <laughs> it's true. You better be careful. She's feisty. <laughs> All right, so once you do that, uh, on your galaxy map, you will have this option to recapture the freighter. It's in the Omega Nebula. Uh, good old Omega Nebula. Yeah. It's like going home again. So. What, 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 what fucking system is that? Aaron Larkan? Yes. I went to high school with a dude named Aaron Larkin. <laughs> really? No. <laughs> so any relation to Aaron Sorkin? Uh, it's possible. Okay. Anyway, you find the Strontium <laughs> Mule and uh, go ahead and board it, and that's the next step. People aren't typically related by first name. <laughs> Is that, that's <laughs> no, not how it works? that's not how it works. <laughs> okay, you kill a bunch of Blue Suns dudes on here, and uh, then you finish the mission, you pick up the payload. I guess they're really going to be blue after this mission. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> They're sad. If you mean like dead and deprived of oxygen, yeah, that's probably it. There you go. Oh, what you got? Boom. Is it sexy? They never show you what you get. Nice. Oh. All right. Then take it off. Look in at your, you. In your, in your space hot rod. Oh, dude, your space hot rod's awesome. So now what do you do, Gus? Okay, so once you recover the artifact from the Strontium Mule, then you find out that they were disabled because the Blue Suns are sending out false distress calls. Those sons of bitches. So now you have to go disable the false distress calls. And the distress calls, the distress calls are coming from? Secret's Cradle. Cradle. Which now is on your map. Right. Just but like that. You, see, you would go up to Dictoris to disable the false signal. That's not what we're interested in, though. No, fuck we're, Dictoris. We're interested in finding a planet called Franklin. And I didn't know where it was at first, so I wandered around a little bit lost. Elementary, my dear Watson, That's that says was... that this is it right here. It's the moon of Watson. <laughs> is it the Watson's moon? Yeah, Franklin right. Watson. I went to high school with a dude named Franklin Did Watson. Did you really? No. I'm guessing you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, there's the there's the anomaly. There, there you go. And then so you uh, do your thing. <laughs> yeah, you <laughs> shoot your space sperm at it. And... <laughs> <laughs> space sperm docked. And uh, <laughs> you land and you got to, I guess some Batarians are launched a couple missiles at a colony and you got to protect the colony by uh, killing all the Batarians and blowing up the missiles. And you did that? Yes. That's pretty impressive. You'll see, though. Oh. There's all, as with many things in Mass Effect, there's always a twist. Isn't that true? That's that's the commander. you got to kill him. Dude. He's a bad guy. I wonder if he's related to that other Batarian from earlier. Maybe. It's possible. Do they have the same first name? <laughs> <laughs> that's a good question. Do they have the same first name? All right. So just kill a bunch of dudes. Use your then, new sniper rifle, I see. Yeah. Once you get through to the end, you got to hack a computer, and they tell you you can only disable one missile. Dude, you're like Angelina Jolie in that movie. <laughs> <laughs> There's so two, wait a minute, you can only disable one yeah, missile? Yeah, there's two missiles coming. You you can either choose to save the industrial district or choose to save the residential oh, district. Oh, so... If you, if you save the industrial, all the people die. If you save the residential, then the alliance... Then it's not a viable colony and everyone has to be evacuated. So I chose to save the industrial because Taylor Shepard's a cold, heartless bitch. That's right. You should uh, get some sort of back-end deal on that. Yeah. I saved a ton of money for the alliance here. It's true. That's really sad, man. I can't believe the... <sighs> <laughs> 
I'm and all depressed about those poor colonies. Colonists. They knew what they were getting into. I guess that's... Is that... I don't even... It's space, dude. It is space. All right. And that's it. And that's how you... Um, you That's how you find Sigurd's Cradle. And then as an unexpected side effect, there's an achievement related to this that I get. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Agent. Which is 50G, by the way. Yeah, it's a big one. You complete five missions for, uh, disco- by... Discovering scanned undiscovered worlds. undiscovered worlds. You don't have to scan five worlds. You just have to complete missions that come from those worlds. Right. Yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching.